In this week's roundup, prehistoric burrows, rare blue whale feeding footage, giant shipworms, and flu-curing frog mucus. Starting off in India, where scientists have discovered a flu-fighting compound in the skin mucus of a colorful frog. When tested on human blood cells, a molecule called uramin successfully killed several viral strains, as well as a number of harmful microbes. Heading south, a team in the Philippines finally discovered what animal makes these mysterious long tubular shells. They call them giant shipworms, but these slimy creatures are actually clam relatives. In more ocean news, this footage is teaching us about the world's biggest animal. When a blue whale opens its mouth, drag slows it to a crawl. Getting going again takes a lot of energy, so the whale will only eat krill clouds that look perfect. Small ones are passed up. In more whale news, boaters in Canada were literally rocked by orcas. The pod came in when a sea lion hid behind one of the vessels. Over to Peru, where short-eared dog pups were caught on camera by the crew at Rainforest Expeditions. These are quite possibly the first recorded glimpses of a jungle dog and her puppies in the wild. The small canids are so elusive that no one knows how many exist. Staying in South America, these bizarre tunnels aren't what you think. Scientists in Brazil discovered they're actually ancient burrows, at least 10,000 years old. It's thought they were dug by giant ground sloths. And as if they needed more, Australia just got 50 new spiders. The arachnid motherload was discovered by 23 scientists working with indigenous rangers and traditional owners. Off to England, where a survey has revealed that the number of urban foxes has quadrupled in the last 20 years. Fox numbers in the wild are in decline, but there are nearly 150,000 in England, one for every 300 people. Rounding off with this awesome GoPro footage, captured in Kruger National Park. That's it for this week. We want your opinions on these nature news stories. Let us know what you think in the comments below.